Brace yourselves for some jaw-dropping revelations. As we bid farewell to the electrifying romance that is Tessa and Hardin's epic love saga, and after everything, it's time to take a sneak peek behind the curtain and discover what lies beyond their steamy on-screen chemistry. From uncovering their real ages to delving into their personal lives, prepare for an inside look at Hero Finds Tiffin and Josephine Langford, the dynamic duo who brought this captivating story to life. Are they just as entangled in each other's arms off camera? Let's unravel all the secrets together. Hero Finds Tiffin is Hardin. Let's take a deeper look into the captivating world of Hero Finds Tiffin, a young actor who has not only left a lasting impression, but also garnered quite a following in the entertainment industry. Born on November 6, 1997, in the vibrant city of London, England, Hero Finds Tiffin is 25 years old and he's a Scorpio, a zodiac sign known for its passion and intensity. It's no surprise that he channels this energy into his acting career, making him one of the most promising talents of his generation. Hero's journey into the world of cinema began at a remarkably young age. In 2009, he made his mark by portraying the young Lord Voldemort in Harry Potter and the Half-Blood Prince. What makes this role even more fascinating is that he acted alongside his uncle, the esteemed Ralph Fiennes, who portrayed Lord Voldemort throughout the Harry Potter film series. This early exposure to the world of acting undoubtedly influenced Hero's path in life. Before his breakthrough in the film industry, Hero Fiennes Stiffen was already making waves as a model. He lent his striking looks and undeniable charm to renowned fashion brands like Burberry and Louis Vuitton. As his career continued to ascend, he became a prominent figure in the fashion world, representing brands like Salvatore Ferragamo and Dior. Transitioning seamlessly from modeling to acting, Hero has graced both the small and silver screens with his talent. His filmography includes projects such as Safe, Cleaning Up, First Love, and The Woman King. Each role showcased his versatility and dedication to his craft, solidifying his status as a rising star in the entertainment industry. Now, let's dive into the topic that's been on everyone's mind, Hero Finds Tiffin's Love Life. While he and Josephine Langford share electric on-screen chemistry as the iconic Tessa and Hardin, their off-screen relationship is that of close friends and co-stars. Hero has also been linked to his after co-star, Inanna Sarkis, who portrayed Molly in the movies, and there have been adorable photos and videos of them together. However, Hero stated in an interview that he has never had a proper relationship or a girlfriend. It appears that his focus remains firmly on honing his acting skills and building his career in the entertainment world. Josephine Langford as Tessa Let's delve even deeper into the captivating world of Josephine Langford, the accomplished Australian actress who's been making waves in the entertainment industry. Born on August 18, 1997, in the vibrant city of Perth, Australia, Josephine is now 26 years old and she's a Leo, known for her magnetic personality and the innate ability to capture attention effortlessly. Interestingly, she shares her remarkable talent with her older sister, the renowned 13 Reasons Why actress Catherine Langford, making their family a hub of extraordinary performers. Beyond her acting prowess, Josephine Langford is a multi-talented individual. As a child, she showcased her musical talent by mastering instruments like the piano, violin, and saxophone. Her creativity extended to songwriting, with one of her compositions earning her the prestigious title of Song of the Year after a captivating performance at a competition. This revelation adds yet another layer of fascination to this rising star, proving that her talents span far beyond the silver screen. Josephine's journey into the world of entertainment began in 2017, and since then, she's left the mark with notable works such as Wish Upon and Moxie. While she's made smaller yet memorable appearances in shows like Wolf Creek and Into the Dark, it was her portrayal of Tessa Young and After that catapulted her into stardom. Her impeccable performance in the role has garnered her a massive following and a dedicated fan base. Now, let's address the mystery surrounding Josephine's personal life. While she prefers to keep her private life out of the limelight, fans can't help but speculate about her relationship status, particularly with their after co-star Hero Finds Tiffin. Their undeniable on-screen chemistry, along with some compelling photos taken away from work, has fueled rumors of a secret romance. 
However, neither Josephine nor Hero has confirmed these speculations, leaving fans eager to uncover the truth behind their close bond formed by portraying love interests in multiple films. Mimi Keen as Natalie Now, let's shift our focus to the talented Mimi Keen, who took the role of Natalie in After Everything. At just 25 years old, she's already making significant waves in the entertainment world. Born on August 5, 1998, under the Leo zodiac sign in London, England, Mimi possesses an irresistible charm that draws you in from the moment she steps into the spotlight. While her portrayal of Natalie may have put her on the radar for some, Mimi's journey in the industry began earlier. Longtime fans may remember her as Cindy in the beloved British soap opera EastEnders. However, it was her role as Ruby in the Netflix series, Sex Education, that truly catapulted her into the hearts of viewers worldwide. Her nuanced performance and relatable character have garnered a dedicated fanbase. Speaking of fans, they were excited to see Mimi join the cast of After Everything. Her presence added a new layer of intrigue to the film, and her chemistry with the rest of the cast was undeniable. But when it comes to her personal life, Mimi tends to keep things under wraps, especially her love life. While fans are curious about her romantic connections, she values her privacy and prefers not to divulge those details. One thing we do know is that she shares a close friendship with her sex education co-stars, including Asa Butterfield. Their bond off-screen mirrors the camaraderie we see on the show, creating a supportive and enjoyable work environment. Benjamin Mascolo as Sebastian Let's turn the spotlight onto Benjamin Mascolo, the charismatic actor who portrayed Sebastian in After Everything. At 30 years old, Benjamin was born on June 20, 1993, under the Gemini zodiac sign, and he hails from the picturesque Modena, Italy. His journey in the world of teen romances has been nothing short of remarkable. Besides After Everything, he's graced the screen in Time Is Up and Game of Love alongside the talented Bella Thorne. But Benjamin Mascola isn't just a versatile actor, he's also a gifted singer with a thriving music career the fans absolutely adore. His multifaceted talent has earned him a special place in the hearts of audiences around the world. Speaking of hearts, fans couldn't help but fall in love with his on-screen and off-screen chemistry. Now, let's dive into the intriguing realm of Benjamin's love life. For three years, from 2019 to 2022, he was in a high-profile relationship with the renowned Bella Thorne. Their love story was both public and passionate, with the couple even announcing their engagement in 2021. They co-starred as love interest in Time Is Up and Game of Love, making their on-screen and off-screen connection all the more captivating. Fast forward to the present, and he's now in a relationship with a mystery girl. While he keeps her identity under wraps, the couple did share a heartwarming photo on Instagram, sparking curiosity among fans eager to know more about this new chapter in his love life. Thanks for watching. Comment who your favorite character from After Everything is. Also comment what you thought about the movie, and don't forget to like and subscribe.